Never used a single water attack, by the way. Time to die? Yep, yeah, probably. It's Star Magician, after all. And everyone knows Star Magician cheats. Cheater! I need to get rid of the Refresh Ball, and I need to get rid of the Guardian Ball. Um, it would probably be better for me to use Magical Shield, right? Played are the tactics 1, 3, 12, and 13. That's fine, we're not actually focusing on Star Magician right now. You and your mind ball. Did I get it pretty good? Yeah. I, what are the few that I played? I think my favorite Final Fantasy is. Probably still 13. Did Mia just get killed immediately? From the mind ball? How dare you kill my healer? Oh, I probably should have healed Sheba. Because you need another one of those. I appreciate him ignoring Sheba. Do this. I probably should cure myself, right? Potent cure myself and then use a wish well. That guard aura is a pain in the butt. I feel like if I can just keep up. The uh, Shurikens would be fine though. Star Magician sucks balls. <laughs> I like how everybody feels the same way about Star Magician. How dare you earnest ply. He has two of the stupid guardian orbs too. I should have been using Megara this entire time. Mistakes were made. Alright, good. We took those two out. Now we just need to kill the other one. Was that a physical attack he just threw at me? I was about to say, don't you dare call another one. Alright, I think she's good there. I think we just magic shield, right? We'll go with the blue bolt. And a, uh, we we'll keep doing wish well. <laughs> oh, it defended. That's fine. Uh, 
Um, I guess I can just shuriken. Then we're gonna go with lava shower. Uh, let's go with the potent cure. And a wish well. That's fine. Not dead yet? There we go. Now it's just a star flipping magician. That's fair. Everybody else is physically attack his face off. Actually, no. You use death leap. Everybody else physically attack his face off. And you heal. Just keep healing. Okay, it's the anger ball. Kill it. Kill it right now. Let's see Shuriken. Uh, let's go with Dragon. No, let's go with Rockfall, right? Blue Bolt. And you just keep healing. Mia, just keep wish welling. Don't stop the heal. Weren't able to kill it in time. That's unfortunate. Keep summoning anger balls. It's kind of annoying. Uh, Shuriken, Demon Knight. I don't think Demon Knight's gonna do anything, is it? Angel Spear, Blue Bolt, another Wish Well. I keep getting free Wish Wells because she gets that MP back immediately. <laughs> So I literally just spam Wishwell for as long as I like. Please let me Wishwell before he moves. Notice I haven't used a summon yet. Okay, that Guardian Orb's gotta die. It's gotta die. Death Leap it. It's gotta die immediately. No Livy. Must die. It's hard to use Jin and summons with these kind of classes. Yeah. That and just overall the fact that he does so much AoE damage. Lowering your stats could be to your detriment. Um, Shuriken, uh, let's go with Molten Bath, uh, let's go with Blue Bolt, and let's go with Wish Well again, because yes. Okay, he didn't summon another, uh, Refresh or Guardian Orb, though, so we're fine. Dang it! Stop summoning the refresh orb, you sack of dirt! Bone bath again. Blue ball again. Wish well. Okay, yeah, it's dead already. Let's go. <laughs> You really weaken your sesame drop out of class? Yeah. That's why I've been trying to avoid using Jin. Honestly, despite the fact that, you know, we haven't I'm, we haven't used any summons, I actually think the fight's going pretty well. Right? The fight's not going half bad at all.
Ah, oh, he summoned the Guardian Orb. Alright, I don't need to heal this turn for the first time in forever. So I can actually take some time to use literally anything else. I became a, I become a savant, but I lose uh, revive, which honestly I, I think it's fine. All my stats go down, but my agility goes back up. Yeah, I thought about doing that, but I, I, I changed my mind somewhere along the line. <sighs> He's got a lot of stuff on the field and I don't like it. I'm gonna I'm still a ninja. I learn I lose death leap and I gain death plunge. I'm gonna use that. Um what's the best way to kill them all without I'm trying to figure out the best way to kill them all. It probably isn't one, right? Because he's just going to use shields. Okay, uh, let's have her summon Megara. I believe Felix is faster than all of them, so it should be fine. Uh, will you shine, Plasm? He had less HP left than I thought. These Anger Balls could really harm us, though. Like, if you do three Mars and we flash it, then you get two-turn Meteor, then spam Fire Energies. I was just gonna spam Megara. Or even someone Horus. Well, at least you only use one of them, right? What's the likelihood that Annihilation will work? Asking for myself. Um, let's get a Cure Well on him and a uh, Wish Well from her. That's fine, we have no intention of hitting anybody else but you. Annihilate! Oh, well, that's a lot of damage. 421? Surprised it didn't die. Unfortunately, those balls are separated. So I can't just use Shuriken. Beat a foe with a strange fan. <laughs> okay. A really strange way to put that. Wish well. That's fine. We just need to kill those balls. That didn't do as much as I thought it would. Probably should have went with Annihilate. Megra's so weak. Shh, you're gonna hurt Megra's feelings. Okay, the refresh orb. Um, we need to kill that immediately. Annihilate it. So annihilation seems so much stronger. Actually, no. Let's use Shuriken. 
right? Bolt and Bath. Blue Bolt. More Wishwell. Summon another one, you jerk! It's basically a place until you get your second Mars Gen. Good, he did a basic attack. Perfect. Now we can use a shuriken on you. Uh, let's use a magic shield, just in case. Blue... Uh, no. You're running low on uh, synergy, so it's probably best not to. Yeah, these buffs are actually helpful. Chat. Me and this Star Magician are going to have a fight. He's starting to get on my nerve with the constant summoning of the, the dude. He gets... He's getting a guard aura every turn. It's kind of annoying. Oh my god, he summoned another one. I'm not doing any damage, so. So is it really? I mean, I guess the healing one would fully mega heal him up back to full. But God, this is so irritating. Father, please, please help me. I can really use your your assistance right now. I've been I'm being waylaid by a bunch of balls, so to speak. And now I have to kill that one before I can do anything. There we go. Alright, you have nothing on the field now. It's now is the time. Now is the time for us to smurf the bad guy. We won't get many other chances to smurf the bad guy than right now. You two pray for protection from balls. <laughs> is Mia dead? Mia's dead. Okay, uh, yeah, this is gonna be fun. Um, Annihilation into... Into Molten Bath. Into Revive. 
I could potentially lose my entirety team, entirety of my team right now. That was the best possible situation I could have asked for right there. Was him doing that. And not attacking. By him not attacking, I survive. That was lucky, yes. That was the best possible situation. That was supposed to be good. I'm gonna start using that then. Do you doubt, sir? Do you doubt? Do do. We not starting that. Um, I need to use a side crystal on myself and a wish well. That's fair. I didn't kill it. I didn't kill it. Oh, he didn't heal. <laughs> oh, I got scared. I got really scared. When it didn't die. I need to check my stats to make sure that I have a... Uh... I need to do the attack up buff. Well, this is annoying. Well, this is real annoying. Uh, Angel Spear. Um, let's go with Blue Bolt, right? And wish well. Yeah, my attack went back down. I didn't even realize it. We are still in this fight, by the way. Spare again. Um, let's go with the cure, potent cure, and wish well, of course. He really is going easy on me. I think I'm just managing him pretty well, right? This could have been much harder if he was able to get off multiple refresher balls and keep them on the field for long periods of time. I'm, I've been lucky enough to be able to one shot them whenever they come out, so they never last, they never last in the field for more than a turn. I think it's the only way I'm ever going to get through this is if I'm able to keep those off the field. Yeah. Now I I will not I will I will admit that I have been getting lucky in some of his attacks where he opts for a basic attack instead of an AOE attack or something like that, or a Mystic Call when he could have just wiped my team out. Well, that's annoying. That was irritating. Um, kind of hard to tell what to do in this situation. That's unfortunate. Uh, 
Uh, he's got another refresher ball out. Let's kill it. This guard R is a pain in the butt. I'm so curious as to how much HP he has left. Kinda hoping that that Guardian Ball would be dead now. It's still not dead yet? <laughs> well, that just happened. totally just happened uh, let's kill this guy finally actually let's just use molten bath on him right there's the star magician we know and know and love <laughs> not wrong god dang it okay it's finally gone And he just calls another one immediately. I hate this guy so very much. I wish he would die. Oh, so very much. Please kill him. Oh, he didn't do the uh, aura thing. I wish I'd use Annihilation. I'm actually gonna have to use a potent cure on uh on her. Uh, so let's go with Helm Splitter. Potent cure on her. Um that leaves her free to do whatever the heck she wants this turn, so let's go with the shine plasma, right? Summon another ball! He didn't blow up, that's good. Ah, oh, it's never ending! It's never ending! If I can just get an extra turn without a guard ball being out, I'd be perfectly great. But, no. He says, screw you and your extra turn without a guard ball. Also, I didn't realize Felix is pretty much out of MP now. God, this fight is still going. <clears throat> Um, I don't have any more MP anything. Oh, she has three. That refresher ball might not die this turn. Oh no, it died this turn. I got a turn, Chet. I got a turn without the ball. I thought he died. I was about to get all happy. <laughs> about to jump for joy. 
Good. I stopped one of the Thunderballs from doing anything to me. If I had pure wish, this would be going so much easier. Shuriken again. Molten Shower again. Blue Bolt again. Wish well. Yes! Okay, it's just another Thunderball. Not having the Guardian Orb out is the best feeling ever. I wasn't, and I had to jinx myself. Let's use Annihilation on him. Go to Rock Slide. Blue Bolt. Eh, we go with Shine Plasma, right? Right? Yeah, and we do it with the Anger Ball. Probably should use Wish Well. I will probably regret not doing that. Huh. I thought at least one of them would die, but I guess not. That's fine. What return to normal? Don't say my attack return to normal. Uh, let's use Angel Spear again, just in case. Frost Spear. Wish well. Golden Sun Bosses taught you patience. Ah, uh, yeah, I lost all my attack buff. Yeah, she just got murdered. Uh, we'll use Flash. Angel Spear. Revive. Summon the Refresher Orb, so now I have to kill it. Let's use Ground. I'd still be a medium. Let's do that. This will stop him for at least one move. The, the healing orb is dead. Team HP heal. Restore some PP. Then I can summon Megara next turn. No! Surprised I'm still alive? I'm surprised I'm still alive too. <laughs> I'm surprised I'm still alive too. Actually, use some Megara. Um, let's use a potion on yourself, right?
Chicken Buster. Moit of them. Someone, Mercury, do the thing. <laughs> it took five years and a lifetime, but we did it! <laughs> that goes a lot easier with Pure Wish. Yes, it definitely does. Go a lot easier with Pure Wish. Let's go! Thank you! That took forever. Got Azul. Four Mercury, three Venus. That's not the one that heals, right? That's not the healer one, right? Get out of this stupid cave. Okay, so that's not something I get until later on, right? Alright, so I think we have to do the Sea of Time Islet. I think I need teleport for that though, right? You need teleport for Sea of Time? Oh, we gotta go to Yalom too. We gotta go all the way down here. We can heal when we get there, too. Alright, so I think I just go straight south. Yeah, I just keep going straight south. I can't move with a flying ship. Trying to remember where that is. <sighs> Saw it before, and I most definitely forgot it. <laughs> I am 100% certain that I forgot all about it. Da da da. You can see it from the Western Sea. Hmm. Western Sea, Western Sea, Western Sea. I have to check the map when I get back out there. Masamune. Wait, isn't that one of those curse blades? Oh no, this is Rising Dragon. Yeah. Yeah, that's the blade that I give to Jenna. Yeah. That's the Jenna blade. Then I get the Meditation Rod and I give that to somebody else like Shiva. Then I take the Cloud, the Dracomance Rod and give that to her. Then I take the Thanos Mace and give that to the cellar. <laughs> oh, 
Wait, what am I doing? Okay. I really should have started Magma Rock. I really, really, really should have started Magma Rock. I'm probably going to regret not doing Magma Rock. But I also should have expected that fight with Star Magician to take as long as it did. All right, so let's do the feather. Dude, could you move faster? Like, I have to leave the town and come back. Move your hiney. Okay, so we gotta leave the town and come back. This, this way we can finally empty our bags of all the processed goods that we had. Or forgeable goods, I should say. Let's see. You will give me aerial gloves. I think I had those already. Or at some point. Speed and wind power. Attack goes down, defense goes up by a bit, agility goes up by a bit. That's a large drop. That's 11 points down. Now I don't think I care about that. I only wish that they could make this whole process quicker. You know? Streamline it a bit. Like, what if... They had originally allowed you to just do a mass drop off of forgeables. Like, hey, forge all five of these items, and then I can pick them up. Instead of the talk to him, watch him walk slowly to his forge, leave the town, come back, talk to his wife, then go back and talk to him. I had a comment mace before. I think he ended up selling it. It was too weak. Yep, I'm gonna sell that one too. Alright, we're gonna do dark matter this time. I forget what the dark ma dark matter makes. It's kind of unfortunate that you can't pick what it turns into um, from like that sh that pool. It's just random from uh, from the pool of items that it can turn into. So you never know what you're going to get. Which is, I guess, fun in its own way, but I would rather have just been able to pick what item I get. <laughs> Terra Show. That kind of looks evil. It's a curse shield. Guess what we're not using? That shield. Okay. Take my Ori Kalkan. Or is it Ori Halkan? That's such a weird name for anything. So after we do all this, we need to go back to Shaman Village. I gotta just shove them out of the way. Do, 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 do. Ah, I went the wrong way, didn't I? Yep. Went the long way. Feel bad about it now. Also, the rusted axe to take care of, too. Nebula wand, that looks cool. I'll give the wand to her just because uh, the sword, it's not that much of a boost from the sword that Jen is using. And since Sheba can't use the sword, it would be kind of silly to take it from her. Alright, now I have the dragon scales I need to do.
Okay, so Shiba didn't have anything. Uh, she has two dragon scales on this character. Or I said dragon skin. I know you can't rush perfection, but man, I wish I could. I wish I could just rush all that perfection. Just rush them right out the door. Like, hurry up! <laughs> bomb, bomb, boom. I talked to the wrong person. We got the dragon helm! Resist water and fire. Plus 70. Or plus 10 to him. Yeah, I'm going to give it to Felix because we use Felix the most and everybody's going to get the, the, the hand-me-downs. Alright, talk to him again. Uh, give the next one to him. This is the one point in time where a mod would be, or playing this on emulator would be the best. Because you could just uh, fast forward him. And not feel bad about it at all. Bless you. The little one sneezed. Now we got the dragon shield. Resist water and fire? Is that the same as the helm? So I guess giving him the shield would be kind of pointless since he's already resisting it. Plus three. Plus ten. Plus seven. No, plus eight. It's plus eight. Plus one. We'll give it to him. Gotta sell that, uh, nut. Alright, so now if I go to the other one... You don't have anything... You don't have anything... You don't have anything... But you... You have something. You have the Stardust and you have the Axe. We're gonna give him the Stardust first and then we'll take the Axe afterwards. I promise, chat, we only have to do this one more time after this. On this stream. Uh, next stream, we'll probably have to do it like three or four more times. Because I'm pretty sure we'll find a bunch of the uh, forgeables. Or, I guess, processables? I'm not entirely sure how they word it. Is the item you want it? Yes. Another Comet Mace. Alright, I only have one thing left for you, sir. He says he's going to give us some elbow, elbow grease and, some, and the spit shine. Okay, up and down. I'll talk to him again just in case to make sure I don't have anything else that I need to uh, turn into uh, usable items. Viking X. Stun Bolt. Okay. Now that that's done, we can sell things and empty our pockets, finally. Well, not Felix, of course. Felix can never empty his pockets. His pockets will forever be full. I 
I feel, I feel like I have a lot of money. But at the same time, I feel like I don't. Trying to see if there's anything here I can sell. Yep. So this seems like the baby's up from her nap. As you guys can probably tell too, because you're probably hearing her <laughs> throwing her toys around. Because it's fun. Okay, so I need to find the rest of these Jenny. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure there's one inside of uh uh Was it Mars Lighthouse? Is it the Western Sea? Where's that at again? Oh, it's over here. Is it near Shaman Village? Ooh, excuse me. So I think we head back towards Shaman Village to get that Jupiter Gin. be there uh oh somehow with the baby she screamed about something okay Almost time for me to go and take over on baby duty. I get, get I get to go and chase the, the the little one around the house until she's tired again, which I doubt she'll I doubt she'll ever be at this point. likely to be when I'm tired. But she just got up from a nap, so most likely she won't be going down for sleep anytime soon. She gonna be up for some time to come. I was actually surprised I just fit, uh, fit through there. Oh, I mean, as you can see, I'm already pretty tired, so. It wouldn't take long for me to be sleepy. Couldn't sleep well last night. The heavy winds kept making a lot of noise. Um... That kept me uh, kind of up. Um, and then we ended our stream pretty late yesterday, so.
I could get comfortable. Mm. So we're going to go and pick up that last Jenny here, and I think that's where we'll call it. Once we get up there and we get that last Jenny. Um, that way I have some time to go and take a shower before dinner and all that stuff. Um, or, yeah, I probably want to do it before dinner. I'll talk to the wife first and see what she says. But most likely I'll end up taking a shower before dinner. Um, and then most likely afterwards me and the wife will watch some anime or... I'll play a video game or something, I don't know. I guess I'll figure that out, all that out once I have the combo with the wife. Don't know what we're doing for dinner. Probably goat cheese, though, if she wants me to make goat cheese. If she doesn't feel like cooking, then I will probably cook before dinner. Unless she wants to order out. Which I'm perfectly fine with as well. Driving down to your folks tonight, assume, assuming you test negative in terms of what, COVID? Ah, yes. And so you want to make sure that you don't have it too, just, just in case. Fair enough. I'm sure they appreciate you being extra cautious. Uh, we'll be doing, we'll be cooking here and then taking the food over to my in-laws so, for Christmas. So I don't know if I'll be going. I know my wife and daughter are going to go, most likely. But uh, I will probably stay home. I might stream on Sunday. Still be a positive from when I had it before Thanksgiving since it says up to 90 days. Potentially up to 90 days. When I had COVID, um, I was testing negative with, um, about 10 days after. So it is possible for you to test negative earlier than that, but uh, the same could be said for you testing positive for it still. I guess it's more like a luck of the draw at that point, right? Will I get lucky enough to test negative? What was even weirder for me was that the at-home test, I took one that uh, said positive and then I took one, uh, another one afterwards just so that I could be sure that I was positive and it said negative. But I went to the doctor and they were like, no, it says positive. You don't have any symptoms? Yeah. You get, you could be asymptomatic, still. I guess at this point it just boils down to whether or not you want to go down there, right? Well, that was a waste. Don't get mad at me. Purgatory! Oh, 
Alright. There's only one more Jupiter Ginny left, and that's the one in Loho. Gasp. I I am now a master. Look at my skills. I am now a master ninja. 